gradually pick up your speed and you stay in the left lane because we're turning left on the next coming intersection otherwise you were supposed to go back to the right lane whenever safe and possible okay stay behind the vehicle in your own lane and uh, maintain the gap to be stopped so that you could see their bumper yes observe both sides see what kind of traffic signal it is so that's most important sometimes there could be a modern signal they might be saying special left turn signals or a preference arrow check for all this thing here also prepare yourself check for the crosswalk see that how many cars will be opposing traffic and if you could observe the speed limits observe the speed limit just relax get yourself ready and don't make rush okay the first car when you stop on the intersection or red light they're supposed to check both sides before they proceed in do you know why uh, to make sure the cross traffic has stopped good cross traffic has stopped whenever it is safe you could make your left turn from left lane to the left lane and then go back to the right lane whenever safe to do so signal mirror look over the shoulder they call them a smog signal mirror look over the shoulder okay okay check both sides still on the intersection there is nothing granted whenever possible go back to the right lane again please okay yeah now blind spot is clear make a right hand turn here signal mirror look over the shoulder watch your blind spots now what is the first sign you see here a uh, speed limit sign for good. the next one good speed will be changing time to time place to place so check it out okay next street make a right hand turn don't give signal too early or too late stop you must stop before the stop line that's one legal position or before the crosswalk or third before the edge of the roadway everything oh. clear you could complete your turn so make a right hand turn complete stop okay turn turn on this intersection please now the difference between this and previous intersection they have a three way stop sign but this one is a single stop sign you stop and must check the cross traffic once it's clear then you could only make a turn okay. the moving traffic always have the right of way you complete your turn since nobody is there now pull over to the side after giving the right signal checking the shoulder and make a three point turn i'm going to show you exactly how to make a three point turn okay now check and give left signal check both sides ease up brake pedal and steer left please in the direction of your shoulder while you're observing cover up your brakes and slow down start to be straight up the tires while you're moving ease up a little bit and just stop without hitting good your wheels are straight yes put into reverse gear give right signal and you're going to steer to the right everything starts with the r check left and look right back and start to steer right cover up your brakes once you pass half check your left side now straight up the tire and watch that you don't hit the curb look back a little bit yeah very good put in to drive left signal check right look left and go left you could go 
going straight. Okay. This part you're going to learn how to negotiate the curb. When you negotiate the curb, you slow down. Stay in your own area, look further away, watch your speed. And when you're coming out, you gradually give a gas and pick up your speed and ease up on your steering wheel to straight it up. Okay. Okay. We're going to repeat the same exercise on the next one. That's what I'm going to see. Lots of people, they run out of the road because they were driving too fast. So they call them, learn to negotiate the curve. Okay. Slow down with the curve. So slow down, stay in your lane. Yeah. Look in the direction where I want to go. Good. Make a right hand turn, please. Now, there's no stop line. So where are you going to stop? Uh, before the sidewalk. Good. Before the crosswalk. Crosswalk. Okay. Before the crosswalk. If no crosswalk, before the sidewalk. Okay. okay. You could creep up a little bit so that you could clearly see the view. So clear view is the biggest one trick. Okay. And if it's clear, then I can just go. Then you could just go. Before we head back to the parking lot again, we're just going to do one more exercise, which is uphill and downhill parkings. Examiner always test them when you go to the test centers for driving test. Okay. You could go ahead straight. Now, when you're in this kind of small neighborhood, still keep observing. You go to the park, keep observing. There could be a kids with their dog. Turn right, please and you have to do it safely by covering the brake check in both sides. Very good. So gradually pick up your speed and ease up on your steering wheel. Looking far up. Always just remember the principle. Look far away, keep your eyes moving. Get a big picture. Make sure you see them, they see you. Okay. Can you see over there, uh, two trees are there. You're going to be do it uphill parking here with the curve. Okay, check the rear view mirror, give a right signal, cover up your brake and slow down and uh, there's a hill with the curve. So once you park uphill with the curve, you angle the wheels to the left. All the way, you lock them up. Then park and apply the parking brake. Good. When you apply the parking brake, you don't touch the switch. Mm -hmm. You just pull it. Once you pull it, you should be able to hear the click click. Okay. So that's why you do it. Now, your wheels, which is wheel on the right side with the curve, is exactly lock up to the curve and the vehicle is straight. Yes. So now, when we get out and we go away, so vehicle doesn't roll back mm -hmm. into the street. So yes. it will be lock up with the curve. You understand, sir? Yes. Okay. Whenever you're ready, you may proceed now. Okay. Release the parking brake. Put into the drive gear. Give left signal and check. Check also your shoulder and little bit gas and straight up your wheel while you're moving up. Very good. Very good. You've done wonderful. Let's repeat it one more time before we head back to the parking lot. Okay. You do it by yourself. So I want to be see how much you learned. Okay. Very good. Signal. Check. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh. You supposed to be steer first before you put into park. Okay. So that you don't do dry steering. So that's known as a dry steering. Mm -hmm. So dry steering is no good for your car. Okay. Okay, so that's one mistake. Proceed up, please. Very good. So you check mirrors, you check the shoulder, and uh, you gradually straight up the wheels. Yes. That's slow down. Watch this car. He's cutting into your lane. Do you yes. notice that? Yes. Yeah, that's known as a sharp turn. 
a left turn turn here please So I will slowly move forward check traffic. Mm -hmm. Yeah, looks empty. Okay. Yeah, then gradually complete your turn. Okay, wonderful. Yeah, as a matter of fact, in this lesson, you did better than the last lesson. So Thank you. Th that's a good progress. That is a sign that uh, you're picking up, grabbing the information. I'm very happy. Turn right, please. still 40 okay. yes you stick to the limit turn left here if the speed limit is not written then you assume it's in 50 yes in the city all in a com even in a commercial area then it will be 50 as well as residential okay unless or otherwise it's written posted okay very good make a left hand turn please Now it's a red light. You stop immediate right to the center. Yes. Okay. Before the stop line, there should be enough gap between you and the crosswalk in case somebody hits you so you don't hit them. Okay. Okay, so that you don't roll into the crosswalks. Yes. Okay. Have a patience. This light may be take a time to be changed because we're entering to a major intersection. Glance on the side and get ready. It's a green now. Okay. So I check on both sides quickly. And the first lane to the first lane. Okay. You always take the shortest route and closest lane. It's okay. Stay here. Stay, okay. You're going to turn left again. Okay. This is a different type of intersection I'm introducing. Check. Go to the left lane. This is a special left turn signal only. Okay. You might stay either inner or the outer lane but I always prefer to use outer lane than inner lane okay the reason is that when you make a turn so you don't have to go to the right lane you're already in the right lane okay. but anyway you're in this lane you may stay in this lane okay and uh, you have a special fully protected left turn signal yes so when you will begin your turn when your own signal will be on okay okay so have a patience and wait and this is a very safe signal yes they introduce to be actually to reduce the number of the collisions on the intersection yes okay this okay. is the only one way they could reduce them i said okay and no matter what kind of signals it is you cannot take nothing is granted so you must check both sides for the cross traffic before you proceed in into the intersection Okay. okay. That's the most important thing. It's a very nice, wonderful day. Eh? Yeah, it's very nice. Yeah, it's sunny. Yeah. yeah. I will also glance on the left side for pedestrian because uh, there's a subway. Sometimes they might jump up too quickly. Okay. Intersections are getting congested, eh? Lot of vehicles are getting, yeah, getting lot of busy. Com commercial trucks are here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and this one is a big intersection too. Yeah. Okay, check both sides. Get yourself ready. Light is there, so it's a special left turn signal. There is no oncoming traffic, but be careful. Do not interfere to the next lane. Now I can change lane, this signal, mirror check, shoulder check. Yes. Signal, mirror, look over the shoulder before you oh. go and change lane gradually. 